let's take a look at uh, this problem recover binary search tree okay we know what is binary search tree a binary search tree uh, the left uh, left nodes are or smaller than the root nodes the right nodes are or bigger than the root nodes so this is a, a perfectly ordered binary search tree now with this binary search tree we randomly swap two of the nodes for example we swap two and three and we get this binary search tree almost sorted but uh, have two elements out of order uh, our goal is to uh, design an algorithm to find those two out of order nodes and fix them and uh, how can we do that a straightforward solution is we can first convert this binary search tree into an array by in order traversal um, once we have that array we can detect out of order elements and uh, then with those two out of order elements we can go back to the original tree and find the two nodes match those value and we can swarm them so um, it's actually uh, converted into a simpler problem how to find uh, uh, two out of order elements in an almost uh, sorted uh, array uh, for example this array if there's two elements get uh, swamped we iterate from left to right um, we will see two times the current uh, the uh, current node is bigger than the next nodes like here the first time second time we see um, is here the current node is bigger than the next nodes and uh, the first time we see that uh, uh, that uh, happen the out of order nodes is actually the um, the current node but uh, the second time we see uh, that happen the out of order node is actually the next node so there is a little bit difference uh, when we see the current node bigger than the next node the, the, uh, the out of order uh, element superposition is different so this code is um, take advantage of that feature um, we loop through when we see this kind of uh, out of order happens uh, we do this the first time we see that we randomly assign y, the, uh, y a value we don't care what this value is at the first time we only care the x value the x value is a uh, current node and then we assign the current node to x and we keep looping the second time we see this happen again um, we assign the next value to y and uh, since we already assign the value to x we don't resign we don't change the x's value and we uh, break out okay this is a, a one path solution to uh, find the out of order uh, elements in our almost sorted array the same principle can be used to um, find the out of order nodes in binary search tree so um, we don't have to convert the binary search tree into an array in order to find the out of order elements we can just do the in order traversal as long as we remember what is the previous node so uh, let's take a look at the solution find the disorder elements uh, we pass in the root, right? In order traversal, standard in order traversal. Um, uh, recursively core left node, recursively core the right node, and uh, process a current node. When we process a current node, um, if the previous node is above the, is bigger than the current node, we know it's out of order, right? We just define the place. Uh, for x and y so the first time uh, we set the x's value to the previous node the second time we see this happen again we set a y's value and we don't change 
x value and we just break out after that we find both the out of order elements for x and y so we find those two nodes then we can just uh, swamp their value. Swamp is really easy. We just uh, have to change their values. And we are done. Um, as we can see, no matter if this is a binary search tree or um, array, the principle is the same. We detect the edge when the, uh, when the out of order happens we first time we set the x value second time we set the y value and we will find those two out of order elements so compare with those two basically they do the same thing this is this problem 